I, um... I never said I was proud of having to do this. Hey guys, it's Spencer, and today, um, well, you, the title just says it all. Tense Laster in 480p. Um, you should tell by my last video, uh, I'm still alive, quote, it's titled, I'm still alive. Um, I, you can see that I was getting really aggravated, <clears throat> and, because, for some reason, something's wrong with my processor, or maybe my, my, it's just like, you know what, fuck you, I'm tired of having to record in 720p. And, well, I did some testing, um, took off all background apps and everything, and, um, just like, did a bunch of stuff. And nothing really worked. So, um, I'm gonna have to record in a 480p. Um, but it's just like this. But instead of like a rectangle, like 720p or, or 720p, basically the full HD shit. Instead of it being a rectangle, now instead it's a square. It's kind of nice, actually, even my OCD. But maybe. It, this one not, might not even be in, um, like, a square, because I think YouTube will let me, like, I think YouTube will, like, go, like, stretch it out to make it look better or something. I mean, my webcam's already in 480p. So my settings have it to basically keep my videos at constant quality. Basically, just so that the videos don't pixelate like they used to. Just at random points. It, it, it made it look ugly as shit. But, um, now they shouldn't. Um, I, I hope they don't. I mean, it, it already bugs me enough that I record in 480p, which, I mean, isn't terrible. I really, I really, I rarely actually ever find a difference in between 480p and 720p. And I can barely even find a difference in 720p to 1080p. So, in all reality, to me, this doesn't make that big of a difference. The difference is just rectangle square now. Um, I don't know if I'll still sell my laptop. I mean... I don't, this, I've only had this thing for a year, though, that's the thing. But yeah, so, thing is, though, I recorded some Outlast videos a while ago, actually, and I've been, I was kind of slacking on rendering them for quite a while, and I've actually got, like, seven parts up privated now. And, um, oh, fuck. There we go. I've got, like, seven of them privated now. Um, I think they're, like, nine parts total. Um, and then there's, like, six or seven parts for the DLC whistleblower. Um... The thing is, though, the intro was kind of jacked up for the first ones. I kind of fixed it for, like, after, like, the third episode or so, because, like, there was, like, static in them, and um, the audio for the static was just, oh my god, it basically makes your ears fucking bleed. I didn't mean for it to be that way. This, the audio that I downloaded the video from, it was just really, really loud. Yeah, that, that's basically how it went. Um, so, yeah, I'll put a... Just them at the very top of the description saying that, hey, be careful when watching the intro because the audio screwed up. I, I actually did make an entirely new intro for the Outlast. It was awesome. Also, there will be more upcoming things later on on my, my channel. I'm not just going to keep playing Call of Duty and like just doing these type of videos. I'll, I'll still do these kind of videos. I like doing these kind, like cut comms, but I want to try something different. You know, like I might, if I can anyway, I'll try having like... um like different video game then next two days later cut comes and two days later that video game again i don't know i haven't even tried this yet um new games coming up are outlast outlast 2 and um like i have four game three or three games other than that it's a new series it's actually going to be called 